Now, uh, I might not know how to cook, but I do know the ingredients. I don't need the extra. <laughs> I do know the ingredients to a great time. Food, music, drinks, and of course, more food. And those are the things that you'll find at the Jekyll Island Shrimp and Grits Festival that's kicking off this weekend. That's right, and we have the Jekyll Island Authority Director of Marketing and Communications, Alexa Orndoff, here to give us all the details. We also brought along executive sous chef in the kitchen, Robert Sartorio. We're gonna get to that in a sec, but tell folks what's going on. Yes, so we're very, very excited. Um, we're kicking off our Shrimp and Grits Festival this weekend. We're in our 14th year. It celebrates the best of Jekyll Island, the best of the South, and we have 32 acres of food and fun for people. So we have an artist market, a Georgia grown alley where you can get handmade provisions and arts and crafts from amazing vendors throughout the state of Georgia. We also have a craft brew fest. You get 30 different tastings of beer options and um, a VIP lounge. So for those looking to kind of relax a little bit, we'll have a big screen TV so they can watch the game catered meals, um, so lots of great opportunities for people to try different things throughout the festival. But of course, we will also have tastings of shrimp and grits. Um, and a big part of that on Saturday will be our cooking competition, where we'll have seven chefs from across the state competing for the title of Georgia's Best Shrimp and Grits presented by Quaker. So we're very excited about that. Um, it's, a, it's a really fun element to the festival and something that people enjoy, all of our chefs enjoy. Um, we have two returning, sh uh, two returning chefs that have won the festival. So that'll also add to a, oh that boy. competition. Yeah. Um, so very excited about that. And then of course we have a new element to the festival this year, the Go For The Grits 5K race, which will take place on nice. Sunday. And you literally are going for the grits. The winners <laughs> will get a bag of grits and early entry into the festival. So it's really fun. Very cool. Awesome. Okay, so as far as, uh, I know you brought some of these cutting boards. Um, what what are like these are some trophies? Are, yes. These are prized yes. trophies. Right. So what are the what are the like key components? Like what are the must do things when you get there? Oh, that's hard to say because everything's so fun. Um, we definitely would tell you if you're coming on Saturday, join in to watch the cooking competition at 11, um, where the chefs will compete for the title. Um, and of course, they'll win a grand prize and a feature on Quaker's website. So we're very excited about that. Yeah. Um, but in addition to that, we have three stages with live music happening throughout the festival. Craft Brew, I definitely, I definitely, obviously, yes. tell you, try Craft <laughs> He's Brew. He's a big fan of it, so <laughs> it's it's something that you definitely want to jump in on. Yes. Um, and I know you mentioned the kitchen. I'm getting ready to head into the kitchen right now. Um, these are great. All the details are on these handy yes. dandy I'm a fans, and you're going to be able to see it on your screen right now. Friday, September 20th, 4 to 9 p.m. Saturday, September 21st, 10 to 9 p.m. Sunday, September 22nd, 10 to, 9, 10 to 4. Free general admission, $12 parking, JekyllIsland.com, shrimp and grits for tickets, but right now Hattie's going to show you what this festival is all about. All right, folks, all right. we are in the kitchen. I am here with the chef himself. Now, what are we whipping uh, we're up? Going, we're actually going to make uh, shrimp and grits. I run a shrimp and grits special, like most restaurants on Jekyll, um, at 80 Ocean, which is where I mainly work out of. I'm also okay. the executive sous chef for the uh, Jekyll Island Club Resort. So, so you kind of know what you're doing here. I know a little <laughs> bit what I'm doing here. Try to at least. All right, uh, so what do you got going in on the right skillet? Right now, I've got, so I got some garlic, I got some bell peppers, I got some shrimp going in there, and I got some tasso ham. And all I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cook them up. Okay. Let the garlic brown up a little bit more than it is. It's already getting close. Cook up the peppers, soften them up. Then the tasso's gonna be with a spice to it, a little bit of extra flavor to it. Love it. And then when I'm done with that, I'm gonna take that little bit of white wine to it. Oh. Put it in there. And let that all just simmer down. And it is sizzling in, in here. It is sizzling a little bit. I'm going to throw in some pepper dew peppers. Um, came up with this recipe. Uh, the Jekyll Island Club actually has the award, an award-winning recipe itself. Um, I believe it won three of the first four years of the actual competition. Very nice. Um, so when I returned to the club, I used to work there back in the early 2000s. When I returned uh, a couple years ago, I said to myself, I want 80 Ocean, which is the restaurant that we opened up two years ago. Yeah. I want that to have a better recipe than the Island Club. So I set out broke it down, went ahead and started making up my own recipe. So So this is this is your own recipe <laughs> right own here. Recipe. This you got the shrimp, you got the grits. I can't wait for this got to the cook shrimp up. And grits. So we're gonna let that simmer down a little bit and then I've got a little sauce I'm gonna put in there and then simmer it all down. This all sauce, right. um, one thing I like to do, I like to take everything out of the uh -huh. food. So this sauce, I take the shrimp shells, we cook them down, make a stock. Good to go. All right. Well, um, thank you so much, Chef. We appreciate this. I can't wait to get a taste of it. And you can get a second serving of it on our website, firstcoastliving.net.